My name's Perry. My name's Nathan. And we're going to be talking about the touch sensor today. But, oh, this is touch sensor. Touch sensor helps determine when the robot has hit a hard object. But why would you use it? To drive across the table until it touches the object, you can then orienteer yourself on the field. And and it can also go in straight line across the whole entire board, as will be proven with Perry, and now we're Perry with program. And I'm gonna tell you what you're gonna need. First, you need two of these move teams. Then you need to go to flow control. A loop that's this and go to events to stop program. That's this. I'm using EV3, it might be different if you're using NXT. So first you hook this up, then put this right there and put that on to make it loop endlessly and then you want to do touch sensor these are all the ones there is call sensor and release is it forces it and releases it bump is a little tap press is a force so force tap then you want to put this move tank on and then Put it at minus all both of these. Then I'm just gonna do four. Then you rotation is you're done. Hook it up, press that. This is what well, first we're gonna use this is attached. First they're gonna use the short one. And then you, it's the same program, but the continuous loop makes it over and over until it hits something. It tells it if it's true. True is nothing hitting it. False is if it's not hitting it. So let's run this. Bad on. Happens all the time. And then you can download the template and use it if I to and see more videos at Compton's Crew dot reset dot net dot and it, it, the down link is going to be in the description below